All right. Um, I haven't had a little bit, haven't had a lot of time to update. I've been, um, I've had a sore knee, been out of action for a couple of days. But anyway, I got got some work done before I got a bump on the knee, so uh, that's okay. So there you go. She, she's painted. Uh, in your bay's got the ice blue on there. Lovely colour that ice blue when it's new. So yeah, so that's all been done and cleaned, and yeah, it was a, quite a lot of work to get that bay. Um, looking good um, So yeah, she's come up really 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 nice. So I've done everything underneath as well. I've done all the um, Under bits all under there. So it's all pretty everywhere um, Yeah, so it's quite a lot of work uh, So yeah, that's where we're up to So that's a, a couple of days of solid work. That's cleaning and prepping and painting and priming and top coating and clearing and yeah it's a it's a it's a substantial amount of work mucking around with this stuff but it's come up really good I'm, I'm super happy with it so I can't complain about that um, you know there's a couple of things that aren't perfect but I mean then this this is a driving car it's not a show car so I'm, I'm wrapped so that's all been repaired all that all well, that's been welded and cleaned up um, yeah there's a couple little divots in there but um, I've got that'll be fixed on the top coat when the guy does the actual painting he's going to be painting from that bit up so we'll get a little bit of a um, little bit of putty in there and fin finish that up so you can see I've um, I've just put just filled in that gap there so that just saves mucking around with trying to make it all, all look good and all that stuff so there's two Normally there's just a little crease in between those two, of course. So yeah, a little bit of putty just to fill that in. Um, so yeah, but it's come up really good. Um, she's nice and shiny and there's all the issues have been fixed up and yeah, she's, she's looking really good. Very happy with that. Um, so yeah, it's been a good, good, little, little, good little bit of experience. So went through a whole whack of wad full of paint, holy moly. So. So I did that bit on the sides as well, not, not, like, not, not as good as the bay. Um, so I've got next job is to put the rubber coat on there. Um, and uh, that'll be that job. And yeah, so as you can see, it's, it's, it's a nice, lovely color. That, it's a, the original color without it fading after 40 years is a really nice color. So um, that's where she is. Anyway, I really haven't got much more to report other than just it's painting that's what it is um so anyway just for information's sake that that is uh well basically it was three coats of well the epoxy primer went on the stuff that i had to fix up with the surface rust and then normal um, surface primer on the rest and then i did a two base coats um and then uh three coats of clear so uh, I have not polished this. This is this is just sort of sitting there drying at the moment. Uh, it's got to take two or three days to dry before you do any polish. But I don't think I'm going to worry about polishing it. I might give it one one twelve hundred grit or something like that. But uh, as it stands, bugger that. So anyway, I'll rip all the paper off everything and uncover everything. Um, so tomorrow I'm going to. Well, I've talked about it a thousand times, the diff's supposed to be here, but I'm, I've given up trying to pick that. Um, so tomorrow I'm just going to start doing the dash job. So, um, yeah, so there's no point pursuing anything more on the bay. There's no point putting in the front suspension yet. Um, so uh, I can no point running the fuel lines and power steering lines just yet. So I really need to know the date for this diff. Um, so that I can plan the mechanical stuff. So, but I'll, I'll finish the, the painting bits. Um, I'll finish the undercar uh, front end parts, get the rubber coat on, like I said, and get all the front end stuff done and get the new wiring sorted out that I needed doing for the bodies, the fan, and air conditioning. So I just got those to run. Um, so that's not nothing too crazy. So yeah. I'll be inside the car tomorrow, which will be good. So, yeah, I'll be in there. Yay! Doing all the electrics. So, yeah. Uh,
said that tail in there because I've been mucking around with the um, the, the the chamber. Um, uh, the plantium. Plantium, plantium, whatever they call it. So, yeah. Um, that's... You can't see it that well. But anyway, that, that's what it is. So, I've cleaned up in there. That's all been redone with a little bit of putty and uh, I've pieced up all the rust and everything. So, that's all done and dusted. Uh, there's only just surface rust and a couple of very small little holes, but uh, they're all addressed. So that's now waterproofed. Now that's all waterproof. The the, the Pentium chamber or whatever they call it. Anyway, um, that's all I'm going to say. I've got nothing else to say. So I'll do an update in a day or two once I've done some work on the dash.